Hey guys, what is up? Today I have some really good news and that is that there is a jailbreak for iOS 8. Now, not everything is completely done and polished, but you can jailbreak any device that can run iOS 8. So that means the iPhone 4S all the way to the 6 and the 6 Plus, including uh, obviously this iPhone 5, which I'm going to be using, the iPod Touches, the iPads, anything they can get up to iOS 8 will work on this jailbreak. Currently, right now, it's only for Windows, and it won't install Cydia, but you can install Cydia after using uh, my next video, which I'll post after this, uh, and get uh, pretty much full functionality, uh, other than the fact that a lot of things haven't been updated except for Cydia, and that's not even supported. And I'll make a video when it is supported, but for now, I'm just going to be showing you how to jailbreak your device. So, what you're going to want to do uh, is get a device you want, plug it into your computer, now you're going to need to download Pengu. The link will be in the description along with the tutorial with all the steps written out. Now you're going to download Pengu and open it like I have right here. Plug in your phone like I just did to your computer via the, the connector. And then secondly you're going to want to make sure iTunes is completely up to date. That was a problem I've been struggling with for a little while because my computer was having problems but once iTunes uh, is up to date. Make sure you go to the software or the Apple Update Manager on on Windows and check that it's up to date. And uh, if you don't get a blue uh, button like this when you start, you might want to toggle this on and off. And PP is basically a installer that you probably don't want. It's not needed for the jailbreak. It's sort of like an adware that the company uh, that made it. So I'll leave it on. But if if you don't want an extra icon and something you're probably not going to use. I recommend that you turn that off. So uh, here we go. Uh, a few more things to note. You're going to want to turn off your passcode on your device. So you can see right here, I have my phone and it goes straight uh, to the beginning. And this is good because uh, sometimes if you don't have it like that, then Pangu doesn't work. And, and lastly, you're going to want to make sure that the over there update uh, on your phone. Uh, did not occur. So if you over the air updated to the version that you're on, you might want to uh, restore or update uh, via iTunes just doing it the long way because that's generally another thing that leads to problems with these current jailbreaks. But without further ado, it's already been a while and we haven't got started so I'm just gonna uh, do it right here. So we're gonna be hitting uh, the blue button in the middle and um, as you can see the progress car uh, bar will pass and uh, eventually we'll be prompted to open it up on our device.
So the installer now, uh, the bar is finished and I believe it's complete. You'll see that uh, I have a spinning wheel on my phone and I'm just going to be waiting uh, for that to restart. So after your phone uh, power cycles, you should get the Pengu icon, and if you opted into the PP installer, uh, then you'll have that. So we'll be opening up uh, Pengu right now, and you can see uh, here you have the Cydia option. Now basically it talks, I believe in this section it talks about how the Cydia hasn't been updated. It has, but you're going to have to manually do it for now. And you can click on the link in the description or the annotation at the end of the video. And I'll be making that video uh, right after this video. But hopefully uh, they update this soon and it works automatically. So uh, you can also install SSH capabilities. So uh, just be hitting install right there. Now this will allow you to SSH into your device which is now uh, has root access so you could install uh, Cydia manually. So uh, there we have that. Uh, and basically your device is jailbroken. Now it was just released a few hours ago and it was uh, pulled off of the Pangu website so it's really in development and I'd recommend just waiting a day or two for uh, a really simple jailbreak that won't require more hassle after that. Uh, but if you are really eager like me and want to try it out uh, then go ahead. If you like this video and you're interested in unlocking your phone, meaning use it with uh, other networks besides the one uh, that you bought it on, for instance this phone is AT&T and if I was uh, to use it uh, while traveling or whatnot, be sure to check out our website Fell Unlocks where you can purchase uh, factory unlocks for your device. Now this is currently the only method uh, due to the restrictions uh, and discontinuation of many software unlocks in the past, but if you need it, uh, make sure uh, to check that out. Also, if you're interested in earning paid applications and gift cards completely for free, trying out new applications, make sure to head over to freeapplife.com on your phone, get started, earn points, uh, and all the rewards that I mentioned. Uh, anyways, thanks for watching this video. I uh, hope the jailbreak went well, and I'll see you guys later.